In this video, let me talk about a way how to add signature in iPhone Notes. My voice is kind of off, by the way, but that's not really a problem, I guess. Uh, well, the thing is that the Notes app is a great way to simply scan a document and add your own signature in case you would like to add or sign some documents or whatever. The Notes app is built in and you have the access to it really fast and it's always there. So there are two ways how to sign a document. So you can use uh, the pre-built signature feature or you can simply use your finger and mark up on the screen and simply use your Apple Pencil and like I say your finger or something to write the signature and that's it. Using the built-in signature feature is really better because you can save your signature for future purposes and you can resize it and rescale it however you want. So the whole process begins with you scanning a document. So that means that you simply go ahead and click on the camera icon in the notes app and you can see and tap on scan documents and you of course put it and just put something in the camera frame. Just make sure that it is aligned and of course hit scan. Adjust the corners of course and make sure to keep the scan. And the next thing is that uh, you click on the share icon. Once you have it just loaded up on the screen you can take a look at it of course. Click on the share icon and if you scroll down a bit you can see the option markup. And this is already the first option because if you click on it you get the access to the pencil and pen tools so you can use your finger to draw a signature to simply like uh, write your name with your finger or apple pencil. But on the other hand you also have the signature feature there so if you click on the plus icon on the side of it you can see it is right there. By the way guys, if you are new on this channel, before we continue with the video of course, I want to say that if you are new here, just consider subscribing because it really does help you with the future videos, because in case there is something interesting for you, then it's going to show up on your YouTube page so you can watch it later. And yeah, you can leave a thumbs up if you like the video so far. So pressing on the plus icon will give you multiple options, including the um, signature and the text. I guess you can use the text field as well, but it's gonna be a type thing and we just want the signature, right? I mean, if there is, uh, if it's enough to like type your name as a signature, then you can use the text field as well. But click on the signature and it's gonna give you multiple options, like of course you can use your pre-saved signature or create a new one if you don't have one just yet. So you're gonna be greeted with a blank page and simply use your finger to type whatever in and if you're okay with it then you just hit done and you can save it as uh, as like a new signature or you can give it like a like label or something where you make it uh, show up as your family family name full name given name or, or whatever or you can even create your own custom label for it or simply hit done and if you're not uh, like um, okay with it or if you just want to retake it there is always the option to clear it you should of course use uh, the line at the bottom as a reference point, so you should keep close to it. I mean, it's not really that important, I guess, but yeah, you just make sure that you add the signature as supposed to. So well, once you're done, then you just of course hit the done, and you just want to add the signature to the to the like placeholder or whatever and it pretty much means that you can resize it re I mean uh, put it and relocate it anywhere you want and it just looks kind of legit and it just looks nice I guess I mean it doesn't have to it's not supposed to look nice but it's supposed to be functional so that would be pretty much it I really do hope that you enjoyed the video besides this main option like I said you can use the finger methods to draw a signature which isn't that good of a thing because you cannot resize it and stuff but anyways I'm ending the video right here I just didn't, don't want to make it as uh, longer than it really needs to be so if you enjoyed it and found some valuable things in it then I would appreciate a thumbs up it does help YouTube with the algorithm it has, does help the video and makes it show up to more people and also you can subscribe so you won't miss future uploads and future videos like these. I really do hope that you enjoyed this one and see you guys later in future uploads.